In India, thousands of farmers from northern India are marching towards the capital, New Delhi. More than 250 unions are leading the protest march against unfulfilled promises made by the government in 2021. A year-long farmer agitation ended in 2021 after the government rolled back three controversial farm laws and promised further concessions to the agitating farmers. Now, security forces have erected barricades along the route of the farmers to stop their tractors from entering Delhi. Prohibitory orders have been imposed in the capital and along the towns that fall on the farmers' route on the national highway. The agitation has once again started from the northern states and is being supported by hundreds of unions across the country. The farmers are set to reach Delhi today as talks between farm leaders and central government ended inconclusively on Monday after many hours. Agriculture Minister Arjun Munda, Commerce and Industry Minister Piyush Goyal met a farmers delegation in Chandigarh on Monday night. अधिकांश ऐसे विषय पर जहां हम सहमति तक पहुंचे लेकिन कुछ इस तरह के विषय जिन विषयों को लेकर के हमने यह कहा था कि इसके बहुत सारे ऐसे जुड़े हुए मामले हैं जिस पर हमें एक अस्थाई समाधान के लिए एक कमेटी बनाने की आवश्यकता है और उसमें हम अपनी सारी बातों को रखें और उसका अस्थाई समाधान ढूंढे अभी भी हम मानते हैं कि किसी भी समस्या का समाधान बातचीत के जरिए हो सकता है हम खुले मन से तैयार हैं। सरकार के पास कोई प्रस्ताव है भी नहीं ठीक है वो सिर्फ केवल का और केवल समय निकालना चाहती है हम लोगों ने पूरी कोशिश की है कि मंत्रियों से हम बातचीत लंबी करें और कोई ना कोई हमारे पक्ष में निर्णय आए और हमें कुछ ऐसा लगा नहीं मीटिंग में the center has learned to have agreed to withdraw the cases against the farmers registered during the 2020-21 agitation. The core demand in the farmers' 12-point agenda is for a law to guarantee minimum support price for all crops and the determination of crop prices in accordance with the Swaminathan Commission's report. This is the minimum price set by the government for certain agricultural products at which the government guarantees to buy the produce directly from the farmers. Other demands range from full debt waiver for farmers and labourers to India's withdrawal from the World Trade Organization and suspension of all free trade agreements.